Finding assets for your game can be time consuming and finding good free ones even harder. But in this video, I've pulled together six Unreal Engine 5 plugins and assets from game systems to sound effects, and they're all completely free. Let's get into the list. The first plugin on the list is Easy Building System V10. If you spend any time working with modular building systems in Unreal, there's a good chance you've come across this one already. But if you haven't, it's easily one of the most complete building systems available for free. What makes it stand out is how fully featured it is right out of the box. You're not just getting a bunch of parts to snap together. This comes with full systems for interaction, damage, upgrading, even structure ownership. Features you'd expect to find in a multiplayer survival game. It has both stylized and polygonal art styles and works across first person, third person, and even top-down perspectives using a layer-based approach. And it's not just about the building either. The UI comes pre-built with intuitive radial and grid menus, which makes structure placement surprisingly smooth. The snapping feels tight and the template handles terrain variation really well. If you've ever played something like Rust or Arc, you'll immediately get the feel this system is going for. The only downside I can see is that they don't have any documentation for the product, which can make it really hard for you to integrate it with your project. But they do have a Discord server which you can use if you're facing any issues. Next up is Dialogue Tree and Quest System. If your game is about player choices shaping the story, Think Detroit Become Human style branching narratives. This asset is basically essential because you can't just check for each dialogue if the player has taken it or not. It goes beyond basic dialogue. You get a full non-linear story builder with branching dialogue, quest handling, cinematics, multi-slot animations, camera control, and even built-in localization and save load mechanics. What really distinguishes it is how it bundles dialogue and quests into a single cohesive tool. You can define dialogue choices that drive quest flow, trigger events, and influence other story branches. It also includes a mini-map system with world to 2D conversion, icons, multiple areas, and a UI settings system. Even if you're not using other toolkits like MSL, the core functionality is already there. It's not beginner level though. You'll need a basic understanding of blueprints. But if you're setting up a choice-driven narrative or RPG, it can seriously cut down on spaghetti logic and messy conditional checks. The creator has also made a whole 10-part video playlist which you can use to integrate this assets in your project. Up next is Assortment of Traps, a free blueprint pack packed with 15 ready-to-use trap types, from swinging blades and trap doors to boulders rolling down a path and exploding bridges. You get high impact options like swinging blades, a rising spike pit, and a collapsing tile array, all set up with working collision, damage triggers, and custom animations. What makes this collection especially useful is that every trap blueprint comes pre-configured with adjustable variables that you can tweak via a clean blueprint graph. There's no wrestling with setting up mechanics from scratch. Not to mention you can tweak the traps to make your own traps. There's also documentation and a linked tutorial series if you want to walk through on how each trap functions in action great if you're implementing them into your levels for the first time. Whether you're building a puzzle dungeon or making survival horror scenario, this pack helps you drop traps in fast without spending hours wiring up visuals or collisions. Unreal Engine isn't the most common choice for anime style games, so finding a quality pack like this is a win. While it only includes two preset characters, its real strength lies in modularity. Each mesh is broken into separate body parts letting you mix and match pieces to create unique avatars. It also includes basic animations along with simple facial animation, which looks all right, but if you don't like these animation, you can always retarget other animation into your character. Officially, it supports UE 5.0, but it does work with current versions of Unreal. Given how few anime style assets are readily available on Fab for Unreal, this one stands out for anyone wanting stylized characters without building from scratch. The only downside I saw was that the lack of description and info about the pack, like there is no trailer, no detailed description, but it does seem to have documentation link, but when I pressed it, it took me to some random site, so I'm not sure if it has documentation or not. Well, it's just a character model, so you don't need much info anyway. Here's a plugin that's incredibly helpful without being flashy, Better Debug. If you've ever been frustrated with constantly converting variables to strings just to print them for debugging, this one solves that headache. It adds custom print nodes for all common variable types, including structs, arrays, maps, sets, and U objects, 
so you can output values directly to the log without manual conversion. You can also control the size of debug text on screen, categorize messages, and filter what gets printed so you're not drowning in text spam. You get to pick and choose what to display, when, and how, without cluttering your viewport during testing. Now let's shift to environment assets with the Fantastic Village Pack. This stylized Fantasy Village kit includes over 400 modular assets, from buildings, walls, gates, and spikes, to furniture, carts, food props, flags, and even stylized water and foliage effects. The modular building pieces let you quickly throw together unique houses and village defenses without wrestling with meshes or textures. It also includes pre-built building blueprints and demo scenes for day and night settings, making it easy to preview layouts and lighting right out of the box. And though interiors aren't included, the asset count includes props like food barrels, carts, signs, fences, and vegetation, so your scenes have plenty of detail. Technically speaking, the pack supports UE 5.0 through UE 5.4, with proper UVs, collision LODs on trees, and hand-painted skyboxes, with optional wind movement shaders for flags, grass, and water effects. It's a great toolkit if you're building an RPG village, a top-down environment, or fantasy hub, especially since it's free on fast. And to wrap things up, here's the RPG music pack. As game developers, music isn't always our strongest suit. And that's exactly where assets like this hold value. This pack includes three royalty-free music tracks, each obviously compatible with Unreal and optimized to loop seamlessly within the engine's audio system. The tracks are titled Wistful Woods, Skylight, and The Wandering Hero. They bring a serene, atmospheric tone perfect for forested areas, exploration sequences, or reflective moments in your RPG. While having only three tracks might sound modest, each one is crafted and mixed with care and well-suited for mood-setting scenes. The fact it's featured in RPG Humble Bundles and Community Game Jams highlights it has been used effectively by other creators. If you're looking for background themes without needing an entire music team or complex licensing, this simple pack is a great fit. That's it for today's list. Hopefully you found something useful for your next project. If you did, feel free to drop a like, and we also have other videos like this, which you should check out.